Okay, hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Spiral 2 Ripto's Rage. I'm Mr. Ronos, and in the last part, we, uh, fit, we, uh, got what we could in, uh, and let's see, uh, whatever, the B, that B12 Sunny Beach, and we completed Ocean Speedway, the bonus level. And in this part, we're gonna do the last level that we can. That level being... Hurricanes, not Colossos, as I said in the last part. Let's go through. Give it a second. Let's see what's happening here. What is that thing? Really, what is that thing? Big purple thing. That that looks weird. Okay. All right, and here we are in Turkos. I almost fell off. That's wonderful. Who's this guy? We've always had trouble with the gear grinders, but now they've set up force fields to separate us. Hi, Tom Kenny. You can use them to turn off the force fields. Who also was the Spyro? I think there's a diode around here somewhere, but my eyesight isn't what it used to be. And, and you know, it's, it's a bit... It's, uh, that voice is a bit more Spongebob than his ice pink voice. To be honest. Not sure why I'm saying that, it's just not to be. Alright. Let's, right, let's take all these guys out. And, uh, break all these fans. Let's see. Get these gems. Um, I don't want to do this. Oh, I almost, I almost did that. Hey, I'm sequence breaking. Hooray! I'm gonna stop doing that. I did that on my practice file, but I'm, I'm gonna be fair and actually do it the, game, the way the game wants me to. But yeah, that is the double jump trick. Ow. Yeah, that's probably one of the few places I can actually do it for a while. Because I think that platform is just low enough where I can I, I can do it just fine. So let's go ahead and get all these gems over here. And, uh, and then we can proceed. Um, you know, I said in the uh, Dalmatians, I should, I should do, uh, Sunshine at some point. I see Barn Sunshine. You know what else I could do? I do one of the Legend of Spyro games. Uh, and I know, I know people really don't like those games for, for some reason. I mean, they're a break away from the formula, I guess. But if that's the only reason you hate them, you, you need a better reason than that. Right, so let's beat up all these enemies over here. And, uh, bye bye. And bye bye. all the gems we can see. Um, what are we gonna do about uh, these things over here? Oh, about, I don't know. Ah, really? Bye bye. Uh, if you're noticing that some that you're hearing like crack, like little crackling noises in the audio, that's not um, the actual recording doing that. That's actually the music in the game. And you may notice that sometimes they may, that the uh, music uh, may actually just not play at all. Same thing. It's because my disc is kind of old. Like I had this game since it came out. So yeah, this isn't even like, like this isn't the clutch's version. This is like the original. What's going on here? Bye bye. Hey, hey, get over here. Get over here. Where'd he go? What do you have to say? No, oh, these gear grinder thieves keep taking our lightning stones. If you can replace them all and activate our generator, I'd be very grateful. But that's that's. Very SpongeBob right there. 
All right, so the goal here is uh, not to actually light all these generators, at least not right now. It's to attract all the the purple people eaters, I guess. Just bring them, draw them out, and then beat them, and then take them all out, and then you can light up the generators, all of them. I don't know what happens if you manage to light them all up before you beat all the guys. I've never, I've never been successful enough to do that. Basically, you'll know when they're coming out. Oh, come on. Yeah. Uh, you'll know when they're coming out. Um, let's see. Yeah. Because that, that's how, that's when they come out. And that's when you need to go after them. <laughs> and this beat them all up. They'll take, they'll take the electric stones, then you just go after them. Oh. Yeah, it's, huh? I hear one. Get, get over here. Bye-bye. Okay, then you just repeat that process and then you just repeat this process until you've beaten them all. Um, I wonder, if I, should, I wonder if I should actually uh, show all this. I mean, I don't think it's gonna take that, honestly. Um, I mean, I don't think it should. Um, but yeah, you just do this until you beat it off. You know, when I actually was doing this, you know, you know, when I was actually about to practice this on my practice mm -hmm. file, uh, I was actually dreading doing this, because I, when I was a kid, I found this annoying. Now, it, after I practiced it, it wasn't that much of a problem. <laughs> Get over here. Ah, I see you. Bye-bye. I'm gonna play catch with me, huh? Not today. Bye bye. I think I saw some guys. Yeah, see ya. Bye bye. And you're dead. Where'd you go? Where did you go? You got away this time, but next time you will be your game. See, if I don't get them all on the next go around, I'll th I think I'll just cut to one actually. Get them, get all the generators lit up. So, uh, so just to let you guys know, uh, after this, we, uh, after this level, uh, we will actually take on the boss of uh, Summer Forest. Oh, another thing, uh, you can, you can actually get everything on your first run here. So don't worry, so don't, so don't worry. <laughs> yeah. Bye. And you're dead. Alright. Where are you? Oh, you can do this again, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. You, you didn't anticipate that I would jump, would you? No. That is your downfall. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, don't worry. If the sign, uh, yeah, you see that counter at the bottom? In case you're ever on your party, yeah, we've got them all. If it go, if the siren goes off again, don't worry. Nothing happens. You've already beaten every one of them. And since you've already done that, you can rest easy and just get this out of the way. That's last one. This Tesla Core will start going. Thank you, Spyro. 
I found this shiny thing mixed up with our lightning stones. Please, <sighs> take it as a reward. I would, you know, I would make a Spongebob reference or a jo Spongebob joke, but I'm not going to. That's, that's too easy. And I say it's too easy because, well, you know, it's Tom Kenny voicing them and it's very close to the, to his actual Spongebob voice. Excuse me? Yeah, I, see, I want to try to be a little, at least a little creative with my jokes, and, you know, not obvious. Yeah, that's, that's not going to happen all the time. Okay, let's just take all these guys out. And take all these robots out, you know. This is another day in the life of Spyro. Apple? Yeah, let's see, yeah. Let's get all these gems just out of the way. Then we want to scour the land for them. Yeah, again, again, apologize for my constant sampling. Wait, hang on. I I'm fine with gems. Yeah, I'm sorry, sorry for my constant sampling. I mean, I'm not sick or anything. Thank God. I mean, dang it, if I was sick, I could I could still do these. Possibly. Ooh. Hmm. For some reason we got... Hmm. It's just like when I landed on top of that idol. I don't remember if I actually did that. In the actual part one. The part one of the house don't remember if, I don't remember if that was like a fail recording or a correct file on the on the real part. I couldn't tell. Hopefully I actually hopefully I actually did it in the part of the, in part two. With the real part two. Uh, that way I don't confuse you guys. Push all these buttons with the power of fire. Because apparently Spyro's breath can do that. Alright, and the last one. This one's gonna be a little tricky. Because it's like you have to round the corner. Let's see if I can get this my first try. I probably won't though. Yep. Alright, give me a second. Let's go that for let's go for a second time. <laughs> Really? Well, then again, I had some trouble. You know, I had some trouble on my practice file getting this too. But ah, Jesus, come on! Stop zapping me, Zoe. I'll zap. Well, zap you. Wait, I don't have. Wait, I don't even have lightning breath in this game. That's in like. <sighs> yeah, lightning breath isn't like. We got one of the GBA games. Really? Ah, Jesus Christ. Come on now. This isn't that hard. At least it shouldn't be. There we go. Yeah, I was about, you know, if, if I kept screwing up more times, I was actually going to just go for a sequence break. Spyro, do you see that big building over there? The gear grinders are using it to steal our electricity. Please help us by shutting down the machinery inside. Uh, sure, SpongeBob, whatever. And yeah, you do have, in those buttons I push, you do have to push them if you want to do this. Because otherwise, these, because otherwise, these uh, fans, propellers, whatever, will spin too fast for you to, for you to even get onto. Although, theoretically, I guess you, I think, I guess it is still possible to get onto them. Like, even if they're going really fast, it's just that you really should make them slow down. That way, you don't have to get, get irritated with just trying to get onto them. We have to say. Spyro, you've done well so far. You can have this little uh, trick for good luck. 
If you have any questions about shutting down the factory, just ask me. Oh, thank you. This very nice orb. Just one more to go. The next glides get tricky. Yeah, trigger, trigger, uh, that, whatever. Not, not really. And watch, I'm gonna fail this somehow. Oh, oh, jeez, Jesus Christ. <laughs> see, see, I almost failed there, but I didn't actually fail. Ah, see, recording curse is not quite in effect. Again, not quite in effect, even though I almost fell off there. Now, this is how the game wants you to get over there. Let's do those platforming challenges, and then get up here. Ooh, it's gonna be close. Ooh, man, nice. Spyro, help! The switch to turn off the gear grinder factory is in that room, but, um, it's awfully noisy in there. Oh, noise, it hurts. Uh, no, whatever. How many drinks do I have? Ah, true. Thanks for shutting down the factory. Here, I found this stuck between the gears. You can have it if you want. Sure. Ooh, a nice tiny orb. And that's every one of them in this level. All we need now are the gems. Oh, and the talisman. Yeah, yeah that's, that's important, I guess. Okay, let me go back this way and see if I didn't miss anything. Let's see. How long have I been recording? Uh, 17 minutes? Yeah, that's fine. I mean, I'm not gonna stop recording until I get this whole over finished. Uh, okay, let me see. I don't think I actually have anything left over here. There's not any... I know there aren't any gems in the area where I have to get the first orb. I know that for sure. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. Gems, where are you? I need you for 100% completion, even though you don't know what that is. You know what? You're not sentient beings. Okay. Now let's try this area again. I don't need to go up there. Okay, I know there are gems over there, but are, are there any out here? Yes, there are. How many now? 170. This way. You know, I'm good. I think the last gems are, are through here. Okay. I think the last one's all purple gems. Hey, look, 2008. In 2013. That was the last year. Thank that, feels, you, that feels so long you ago. Deactivated all of yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Beat all the bad guys. Oh, my talisman, thank you. It's gear. How appropriate. Okay, this gem. And Hercos is complete. Let's get out of here. This place is starting to depress me. It's very dark. Oh, can we get the shiny thing? Oh, too bad. Oh. I don't think those glasses are broken, but they probably are. And that's Herco's done. What next? Well oh. done, Spyro. Now that you have six talismans, this door will open. Good. Okay, Spyro, jump through that hole in the floor to get down to Crush's dungeon. I'll help you by tossing sheep through the hole if I can catch them. Good luck. All right. Crush's dungeon. And the next part, we will take on Crush, the fur one of two of uh, Ripto's minions. And with that said, I will see you guys then.
take care.